Alright, um gonna say I'm gonna have a been having a surgeon problem, like it's been been acting really weird when he's accelerating on the freeway uphill and shit. So I was just looking at it. Um some people have told me to start running better gas because I know I have been running shitty gas it's just been cheaper. Uh, but I've been running like Safeway brand full fit bad stuff. They told me to run and I've been running 89 all chain. They told me to run like Chevron or Shell and uh, 92 all chain. And then also to replace my thermostat with a 180 degree one instead of 195 one that it's got here. So I replaced that. Forgot to drain a, a lot of the radiator fluid, so I got radiator fluid all up under there and under the car and everything. So whatever. Um, and I don't know if you could hear it. So I'm making the noise right now. But yeah, okay, there you go. The water pump making that noise. So that needs to be replaced, so that doesn't go out on me. Right now that coolant that's up in the manifold is turning off. And I checked the injectors, uh, and they look, they look, they seem fine. Once I get that water pump replaced, it'll stop that fucking annoying ass rattle too. It doesn't do it when it's a uh, when you just rev it at idle. Got the coolant sensor to to replace, but ah oh, no, no, nobody told me to replace that. And then oh, really trying to smoke out there. But yeah, um, and then I don't really, I don't know, I don't really want to mess with it. It's kind of a bitch to get to. I'm gonna shut it down. I'm gonna soak up some of that with a rag. I don't wanna burn all that off. I don't like smoke. as much as I can. Whoa. Frown my rag. <laughs> Don't want to touch the exhaust manifold. Yeah. Anyway. Just going on with that, really. Still have yet to get the hood fixed. You know, bungee cords. And then... My, uh, I took it. I took it to tire place to get a wheel on it because it shakes real bad at higher speed and stuff. And they pretty much, I mean, not a wheel alignment, a wheel balance. I need alignment too, but I wasn't gonna do that. They're pretty much telling me my tires are shot. They're saying actually, they're saying this one's the only good one because like all oh, the sidewall, it's all good. 
but all my other ones have these cracks all the way all the way around it yeah. and that's really bad surprisingly I didn't notice that plus I mean kind of low on tread too a little bit there, but, but yeah, right over here too. Yeah, it's all cracked. It's all cracked and really bad. This one actually loses tire pressure pretty good. I mean, yeah, it's the same amount of tread. It loses tire pressure like pretty quick. Like I put air in it the other day and I checked it, it was at like 15 pounds. Must be at like 35. Eh, this one doesn't really. There's no cracks in this one. Ball. It's still the whole sidewall is pretty much like rubbed down because uh because the my sister doesn't know how to park next to a curb, so that's why there's so much curb rash along the rim itself too. But then the tread on this one is just horrible because the wheel alignment. So it's on this outer edge. A little more in there, there's some, but on the outside, it's really bad. Yeah. That's it for now. Peace.